Get a move on. Just cos I set the stall up for you, don't mean to say I've got to be sitting on it all day. Oh, I never asked you to, did I? Oi, what's going on? Madam here got trash last night. She ain't even started work yet. I oh, weren't that bad. You don't have to walk me. I know which way it is. Well, if you're serious about making a goddess, you've got to buck your ideas up. Well, I can handle it. It ain't even an hangover. Miss <sighs> Daisy. So Hey, you know the best way to cure a hangover is to drink a strong cup of ginger tea with honey. I'm ill. It ain't a hangover, all right? Well, if you say so. Leave it, Patrick. So what's wrong with you? I'm fine. Oh, OK. I thought you might want your final plate, Patrick. Mm. All right. Fantastic. Well, you've inherited cat still, and I've got Alfie's. Listen, just because your cousin copped off with my cousin, it don't mean I'm up for grabs, all right? Right. I'll try and resist your charms, then. Good. Now, do me a favour and get lost. Stacey, watch the store for us, will you? What's Phil playing at? Lunch. Right, well, if you're not back in half an hour, I'm giving him all your stock away. All right. Ruby, where are you going? Cuff. I'm sorry, you've got the ump with me or something. No, you should have wound my dad up like that. I'm sorry it got a bit out of hand, but I was right, wasn't I? Your dad being nice was all in act. A bit out of hand, it nearly turned into a full blown fight. I said this is a flaming head case. I didn't say that. Well, he's mental rolling around in them turkey bones, saying what he did to Julie. He only said it because he was upset. Oh, and that's an excuse, is it? He didn't mean it, he was wound up. It's really hurting him. Oh, come on, Rob, don't tell me if you feel sorry for him. No, but he's still my dad. No, I'm really sorry. It's all right, I've got to go see you later. <laughs> The no. Which is on pills for the hymn. Oh, I told you I'm fine and I don't need anything. Okay. I'll leave them there just in case. Stace, what about this one? Oh, yeah. Son, you'll love that. Nice colour, is it? Yeah. Oh, well, no, I mean, it's a colour, do you? Uh, what about this one here with the long sleeves, then, eh? I'll tell you what, Jim, if you don't leave me alone, I'm going to wrap this round your neck. Nice try, Jim. What is it with people today? All I've had is people coming back for refunds and mental geriatrics. I'm sick of it. Yeah, well, don't give up now, cos Jim will be quids in. What? Patrick's running a book on how long you're gonna last on a stool. Jim's got till three o'clock. Cheeky sods. Right. Jake? Oh, it's gone 6.30, Stace. Four days' work, nothing like it, eh? Say, I've told you she could do it. She's a slater. Yeah, but you bet on her quitting. Well, that's all bets are all then, isn't it? Cos she lasted all day. There is no winner. Ah, uh, afraid not, Jim. Uh, Jig bet she'd last the whole day. Cheers, Patrick. There you go, Stace. Yeah, that's not fair. That's insider trading, that is. It's a fix. Well, it's not exactly licensed betting, is it? What time do you have to be from the machine, then? 4.30. Oh, shame on you. You should know me better than that. Stubborn little bear, aren't you? I'll see you later. Oi, where are you going? Are you going to get the drinks in with your winnings? Well, I'm underage, aren't you know? I? Besides, I don't feel like I'm facing another drink. Uh, anyway. Let me guess. You're never going to drink again? Oh, no, I'll drink again, just not tonight, that's all. <laughs> See you tomorrow. See ya.